So I told you all just now, Masma got a lot of computational methods. Masma, inside Masma, there are a lot of computational methods. So there are examples. I'm going to give you some example of the computational methods in Masma. Okay? We are going to cover some of them, not all of them. Okay? I just show you some of the computational methods. The first is the design storm, which we are going to cover. The second is the big discharge, computation of the big discharge, which we are going to cover. Third is reservoir routing, which we are going to cover. And the design detention basin, yes, we are going to do that. And also design of sediment basin, no, we are not going to do that. Okay, we just don't have time. On site detention, yes, we are going to do that. Cover design, no. Hydrological modeling, no. Hydraulic modeling, no. So, these are just a list of the method. It's not complete. Uh, I just list down the main computational method in mass math. Okay, just to give you an idea. Now, after today, you know, because we only cover a few, maybe there are other books we're going to have seminar later cover the other topics. You know, we can always have other seminar later to cover the other topics. Because it's just not possible to cover everything. Right? Let's be realistic. Right? Let's be realistic. Right? It's not possible to cover everything in details. Right? Okay, the first method the first, uh, not the method, the part B, the first topic we are going to talk is about computational of design storm. Okay? Computational of design storm. Compared to the old procedure, the old procedure is the, the one in yellow, the planning and design procedure number one. What are the difference between mass and the old procedure, the planning design procedure number one, what are the difference? What are the difference? Okay. The difference in the approach is that MASMA use a set of polynomial curve for all the 35 major urban centers in Malaysia. Whereas the PDP one only have 11 city. Only 11 city. And also they use isoplan. I'm going to show you how you can do this one manually. How you compute this uh, polynomial equation using design storm. I'm not going to cover the whole procedure, the planning and design procedure. I'm not going to cover that. All I'm going to do, I'm going to cover the first one, the, the new urban uh, storm water management manual, the new procedure. With that, I will go to my notes. And this is the note in front of you. I'm sure you have a set. What you do is go to the page, part B. six hours or less. A lot of people ask me, what happened the catchment is more than six hours? Does that mean that we cannot use? Actually, you are not supposed to use. It's not recommended if your, your storm duration more than six hours. You are, you are not recommended to use. 
huh? the, 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 the procedure in mass mark. What you should do is, you go to the hydrological procedure number one. Huh? Hydrological procedure number one, if the hour, the duration is greater. There are a lot of uh, write up here is for you to read, but the key thing is this one. This is the key uh, diagram. This one. For how to do design storm computation, how to compute design storm. Actually, the method very simple, and I'm sure many of you already know. I'm sure many of you already know. But for the benefit of those who are non civil, I don't mean non civilized people, I mean non civil engineering people. Uh, no, I, I will explain. Okay. The method is this. I'll show you a spreadsheet later. For the coefficient A, B, C, you need to know the coefficient A, B, C, D for appendix 13A. Appendix 13A is at the back. It's, it's in the notes. At the back, appendix 13A. 13A. 1 point, uh, 13A at the back. It's all, all photocopied behind the notes, whatever references here. Yeah. Appendix 13A. You get the ABCD, for location that's in India, huh? Yeah. Appendix 13A. Yeah. Appendix 13A. Yeah. Okay. Appendix 13A. Yeah. Appendix 13A. Yeah. For location, let's say Ipo. Let's say we, des we do the design computation for rainfall for Ipo. Then we need to find ABCD for Ipo, the coefficient. Huh? So it's at the back here, for the state of para, Ipo, what is the coefficient? Huh? And then you plug into this equation. You plug into this equation. And they will give you the hydrograph. Hmm? They will give you the hydrograph. Uh, the, the not hydrograph, the IMD curve or IDF curve. You plug into the formula equation 2.1 in mass mark. You get the IDF curve. And then, if you need to compute the area reduction factor, The method is in table 2.1. Your table 2.1, page 8, every reduction factor. <coughs> and you apply the storm profile, you get the design storm. Show you one more example, book example 2.1, page 10. In the notes. Yeah. Book example 2.1. Explain. Explain how you do that for people. All the steps I explained there. It's the steps are really simple. It's only actually just finding the ABCD substitute in equation 2.1. And that's it. But how you compute? I show you a spreadsheet. Okay? I download the spreadsheet. You can download this spreadsheet.